To log into GeoTab Drive, start by entering your username and password and select Login. Once your credentials are confirmed, the system will synchronize your data, including your driver profile, shipment information, HOS logs, and DVIR records before loading the main interface. Next, select your vehicle. You may be prompted with the last vehicle you selected. To use the same vehicle again, select Continue, or to change vehicles, press Select Another Vehicle. Select any vehicle listed, or search by vehicle name, VIN, serial number, or license plate, and select. If you will not be driving, select No Vehicle. From the following page, select a trailer. If you are hauling the same trailer, click Continue to proceed. To remove it, click the minus sign. For a different trailer, select Attach Another Trailer and pick from the list. To add a new trailer not already in the list, after typing the name, select Add. If there are any pending log edits, the next screen will prompt you to accept or reject those changes. To review the proposed edit, click on any log highlighted in yellow and select either Accept or Reject. After reviewing all days, drivers can scroll to the bottom and select Accept and Verify All Days if all logs are correct. Select the Agree button to certify. If the vehicle you selected was driven without a driver logged in, you will be prompted to claim unassigned logs. Select any logs that belong to you, then press Assign to Me. If none of the logs belong to you, select Skip. Next is the DVIR Inspection screen. Press the Inspect button to begin your DVIR, or Skip if one is not required. Start by reviewing the previous DVIR for your vehicle, noting any defects and repairs. If all information is correct, certify the previous inspection, which will place you on duty. You are now ready to do a new inspection. Perform your walk around and note any defects. If there are none, touch the No Defects button. If there are defects, select the part, then Defect. Select the inspection type, enter any remarks, and sign your DVIR by certifying the vehicle was inspected in compliance with regional and or federal regulations. If applicable, repeat the same process with any trailers. Select Inspect, review the previous DVIR, and certify the previous inspection if there was one. Complete your walk around for the trailer and note any defects. Select No Defects if there are none, or select the appropriate part and defect and the inspection type and sign your DVIR. You are now on the GeoTab Drive dashboard and ready to begin your day.